we have uh, approximately 200 body cameras um, that are being used uh, by the specialized units of the police department. We're talking about the special, special patrol unit as well as the GI3. Um, these are cameras that are worn by the police officers um, basically to give us insight uh, into the interaction that police officers have with members of the public um, and it certainly adds a whole layer of accountability um, in terms of how we approach because that's something that uh, our administration has been very adamant about changing that culture um, that has been there for so many years. So I think that body cams are certainly a way of getting um, the full picture because many times um, people who are recording will splice their video and you only end up seeing uh, the bad uh, interaction from the police officers and so this would then enable us to see what prompted or what led to uh, certain interactions with members of the public. Minister, uh, when, it, when, it, when it actually comes to those um, body cams, is there legislation to support those to be used in a court of law? Um, as far as I'm aware, yes, but we are working along with the Attorney General's Ministry to ensure um, that it can be tightened to the extent to ensure that it's admissible in court. Um, so that is very important as well for us to be able to utilize it in a court of law. 